What's up YouTube? My name is Clickwood and I am back again today bringing you guys another episode of the Pink Slip series here on my channel and today we are playing for two cards. We are going to be playing for the 99 Derek Brooks card and also the 98 Ronnie Lott card. Both of these ones are starters for most people's teams so I hope you guys enjoy the, today's content. I have my opponent already picked out. He is actually a fellow YouTuber. Um, he doesn't have a big channel yet but I saw in the description of his Twitter account that he did have a YouTube channel, so I will be linking that in the description below if you guys are interested. I don't know if he's going to be recording and playing this game on his own channel, but either way, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks. Alright, it is the first play of the game on offense for me, and we're going to go outside zone right away, and we've got the edge with CJ, and oh man, he barely got that shoestring tackle. That could have been a huge gain. All right, here we go. We're going to go with the read option here. All right. And he didn't play that well at all. Let's go, Walter. Let's go. Run this guy over. Oh, all right. Still a big game, though. I'll take it. Oh, I injured him, too. Second and six now. We're going to go with the buck sweep here. We got that blocking. We got that blocking. There we go. Too, too fast, baby. Too fast. 7-0 to start it off. First drive of the game is always a good thing. Gotta love it. We took him down well before the 20-yard line, which is always a good way to start things off on defense. Um, I have to make sure, though, that I do not allow him to gain big yards here opening drive. And that was well played there. We didn't get blocked with Derek Johnson. That's always nice. So with the lack of success that he had running the ball there on first down, I usually expect people to pass. And he does here, which is why I like to hit him with his zone coverage here. And, oh, we nearly got that pick. That almost went exactly how I wanted it to go. So it is third and ten now. We are going to go with another zone coverage here. And it's going to be a play action. He's going to go probably over the middle here to his tight end. Oh, and I nearly picked that. I saw that thing the whole way. First drive went very well. And I'm going to try and continue that on this drive. I'm going to run a standard option here, which is not a play that I commonly run. We'll see what happens. And he does go with the running back to stop there and we break loose with Walter switch hands Walter there you go oh gosh nearly I thought he was gonna fumble there he's carrying that thing like a loaf of bread first and ten now gets to Josh Gordon again there we go there you go Gordon good gain first down second and ten here we're gonna go with curls here and I get smashed in the backfield with a sack Greg Hardy takes me down third and 18 now and uh, I'm going to just do my best to not turn the ball over, but I am probably going to throw a risky pass here. We'll see what happens. Get it, Josh. Oh, baby. Oh, he dropped it. Are you kidding me, Josh Gordon? No. Oh, he had that. All right, we are just going to take our three points here. Hopefully I don't shank this. Yeah, good kick. All right, 10 nothing. We'll take it. Not a bad start to the game. Back on defense now, and I'm assuming that he's probably going to try and establish the run, and he is. And we take him down in the backfield. I'm predicting what he's going to do pretty well so far. I'm expecting another pass here on second and long. It's second and 11 here. He might run, but we'll see. Yeah, another pass, just as I expected. And, oh man, that was a risky throw. He got lucky that that was such a bad throw, because otherwise that would have probably been picked. Third and three, and he could really go with anything here. I am expecting the pass, but I'm not going to overcommit on it. And he is going to pass, and it lags out, and we stop him before the first down. We'll take that fourth and one. He might go for it here. I don't know. So he is going to go for it here on fourth and one. I don't know what the play call is going to be here. Um, I'm expecting run, but you know, nope, he is going to pass here. And he does complete it there. Good, good pass. That was to Fred Bolitnikoff for a first down. He seems to be loving throwing over the middle, so I'm going to try and bait him in here uh, with Derek Brooks and see what we can do. Nope, he is going to run here. Oh, beautiful. Charles Woodson is just the man in run stopping. Seriously, holy cow. All right, let's try that again here. We are going to run another cover two here. See if he can throw it over the middle. I want him to. Oh, Gibson. Oh, what a pick. Oh, baby, to Sean Gibson. Oh, baby. What a pick. He was able to stop me on that last drive, but I'm going to try and go with a halfback screen here. This play usually works out pretty well for me, and he is going to blitz a lot, which means that I'm going to have some blocking here. 
and we get a nice first down there. That could have been better if I would have not run so crappily, but worked out anyway for a first down. Third and eight now, and I am going to look to convert here with the passing game. Oh, what a throw. Oh, baby. There you go, Josh Gordon. That's how you make up for that previous drop, boy. Good catch, good catch. Run defense again, and he's got to go 86 yards to get into the end zone. Uh, he does need to put up points before the end of the half, or it's going to be a tough, tough second half for him. So let's see what we can do here on defense. He's going to go play action. And, oh man, Derek Brooks. I'm telling you guys, this card is the best coverage linebacker in the game. I love to user him. He probably would have made that play on his own. So we're back on offense after that interception. We've got 42 seconds left to put some points on the board here. And we are going to go read option again. Oh, he played that one really, really well. He came in, and it looked like I was going to get past him, but then he came back and hit me. Third and 14, we are going to run another option here, and hopefully we get the good blocking. And it looks like, oh gosh, yep, he, he played that well with his defensive end, and there wasn't much I could do there. Donald finally didn't come through for me for once. He didn't get that block on the edge like, he th like I thought he was going to. So we are going to take our three points with the field goal here. First and 10, we are back on defense here. Oh, that could have been picked. That could have been picked. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, nice sack. There we go. Von Miller, the newest addition to my defense, just got that sack. And now we are having him in a third and 20. This is a great situation for me to be in. He's going to go over the middle, and it's intercepted by Sean Taylor. We've got seven seconds here to get down. And... Or are we gonna go for the return? Nope. And I am going to take my three points here at the end of the half to go up 23 to zero. Still is a three score game going into the half, but this is starting to get out of hand. If he can't put any points on the board in the second half, uh, early in the second half, this game's gonna be out of control. He has had a really tough time throwing against zone defense, and I'm gonna keep testing him with it, and uh, hopefully he throws another pick. Oh, nearly picked again by Sean Taylor. Oh, man. I do not want him to be uh, having time to make throws down the field here. Oh, what a pass. That was perfect. That was a perfect throw. Absolutely perfect. And a huge gain for him there on third and long. Can't really hate. That was a good throw. More zone coverage here. It is second and ten. And I want him to throw it over the middle again. Kind of did there, but wasn't quite right to me like he has in the past. Third and 12 now. It's going to be more zone coverage. I'm going to keep trying him with zone coverage as long as he's going to keep testing me over the middle. And Oh, another pick. That's Champ Bailey this time. This one could be a big gain. And he's going to break free. This thing's going to the house. Champ Bailey, baby. That's right. Madden 25, Champ Bailey. And he's going to score here to go up 30-0. to zero. And uh, this is getting to be, like I said, out of hand. It looks like he's just going to run out clock here. Maybe he's conceding at this point. And it's hard to blame him when he's down 30 to nothing. But um, I'm going to keep playing hard. I'm going to keep playing hard. Oh, good throw. He, he is so risky with his passes. Oh, another pick by Sean Taylor. A risky throw there. And uh, we are going to take the ball back on offense here. Start of the fourth quarter now. And uh, this game is pretty well in control for me at this point. I'm feeling pretty good. And I'm just going to try and run out as much clock here as I can on offense. Try and put this game away, you know what I mean? Okay, so it's fourth and five. And I know you guys are thinking that I'm trying to run up the score here by going for it. But the reality is, is that I'm trying to keep the ball on offense so that I can run out more clock. That's honestly all that it is. So I'm going to run a screen pass here, try and pick up the first down and run out as much clock as I can here. And he does knock it away, but that's okay. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Back on defense, and we'll see if my opponent's going to try and run out some clock as well. I don't know if he will. Nope, he is going to continue to pass. Um, so he hasn't given up all hope yet at this point. And he does get a nice completion there to Fred Belitnikoff, his third catch of the game. At this point, it's just a question of if we're going to keep the shutout. I am going to try and keep the shutout, but I don't know if it'll happen for me. Good completion there. Another comeback route there. 
Uh, that time was Steve Largent for a nice catch. Minute 32 left. Oh, wow. I saw that one coming. We forced the fumble, though, and uh, that looked like a real fumble, so that this could be the end of the game here. Okay, so this could probably go for a touchdown right now, but I am just going to dive onto the ground and run out the rest of the clock. Um, it was a good game. I, I know 30 to zero doesn't really uh, tell that story very well, um, but on defense, he made some good stops. He just made too many risky throws on offense, and, and uh, when you've got a secondary like mine, I, I mean, I've got basically pretty much all 99s. I've got a couple 98s mixed in, but uh, it's it's a really, really good secondary. It's tough to throw on this secondary when I'm in zone coverage. They tend to make really good plays on the ball, which is awesome for me. But I hope you enjoyed today's game anyway. Um, I am going to keep Derek Johnson and Ronnie Lott in this case, so I'm happy about that. Derek Johnson probably, or, or excuse me, I, I just said Derek Johnson. Derek Brooks, excuse me. I'm going to keep Derek Brooks and, and Derek Johnson, I guess, technically. Um, but uh, Derek Brooks is probably going to remain in my lineup for the foreseeable, foreseeable future. He is the best coverage linebacker in the game, like I said. Ronnie Lott's probably going to the auction block. Uh, but uh, with that being said, guys, like I said, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you leave a like. Don't forget to leave a comment as well. Let me know what you guys want to play for next week. Is there a specific card out there in like the 100,000 to 250,000 range that you guys want to play for? If there is, leave it in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys want to see in the future. Thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.